Hello, and it's Friday, and I'm back, and it's time for Flowers for the Weekend. I'm with you from now till Christmas, bringing you one design a day, oh, a Friday, to make you any inspiration and give you some help with all your floral activity. We're kicking off as autumn has arrived with some beautiful autumn flowers and a little sculpture that I made, a little structure that I've made from <clears throat> some twigs and some paper covered wire, a tripod, and then making sure everything is nice and secure so that it will support my flowers in, uh, in some water. Look at these, aren't they fantastic? They are Vesalis. Mine grow very small in the garden, so obviously I'm not feeding them enough, but they really uh, do convey that autumn um, theme that I'm looking for with this design. So they're going in and securing onto the stems of the twigs and uh, look how lovely length on that so they can go onto here and another one i hope you have uh, had a good summer we certainly have here at beacon hill cottage we had a very successful production of as you like it and uh, as some of you may have seen and of course this September the weather has been fabulous but I think the time seems to be running very very quickly. Another of my favourite autumn blooms is the Tom Pierce Croissant. Lovely golden head that will sit nicely in the centre of our design varying the heights to give us some good interest and um, really really lovely colour and uh, the perfect flower for this type of autumnal design. If you need to secure your flower then you can secure it with a little bit of the paper covered wire. To that I'm going to add some little Gemini, the wonderful little gerbera flower and a couple more going in at a lower level everything beginning to take shape good color throughout the design and then to finish with i've got some of the spray chrysanthemum which uh, will just give me some nice bulk at the bottom a nice bulk of color that's what we need isn't it to finish off our autumnal design that gerbera needs a little bit of a helping hand. Paper covered wire, can't do without it. So I will continue to just fiddle with my construction, adding a few more of the chrysanthemums, just at a lower level, making sure they're in the water. And then the ones that I've cut off just popping those in singularly and I think for something a little bit different this autumn here we have it and of course you can always use the structure again with something else which we might do later in the season anyway that's all from, from me flowers for the weekend I'll see you soon